Will the world be taken over by robots, controlled by rodents? This is so freaky, but I want it to happen. That's the only conclusion I can come to after learning that a recently developed android named Gordon, you could think of a better name than that, is first to be controlled by living brain tissue, living rat brain tissue. 100,000 cultured rat neurons found in Bill's hair send electrical impulses to drive the wheels of the robots as well as to react to the surrounding environment. Allison, I go to you because apparently you're the expert on this. Mm. Scientists claim this will shed light on the building blocks of memory, but I claim I'll be serving a rat bot master in no time. What do you claim? Uh, I claim that rats are smarter than they look. Really? Uh, yes, and I know this because they uh, all convene outside of my apartment in New York City every night, and I suspected they were up to something. <laughs> yes. Uh, but I just didn't Ooh. know that they were devising new forms of artificial intelligence. I mm. thought they were just eating the garbage. It's very strange. <laughs> I mean, if you have rats that scurry around, why are you creating robots that scurry around? If you don't need them, you already have rats. That's why create uh, uh, facsimiles? Is that what they're called? Buzz, I'm yeah. losing my train of thought here, <laughs> yeah. so you must save me. Gordon not only has the ability to learn this, this android, but the ability ability to display personality traits. Isn't this Frankenstein stuff we're talking about? I think it's just, uh, you know, we're just a few days away from robot syphilis. <laughs> oh, I hope so. <laughs> I know who's going to give it to him. Yes, yes. <laughs> well, you know, <laughs> it's, a, it's a West Coast thing. <laughs> of course. <laughs> also, they're going to figure out that rats are born with cancer, so all this cancer research thing is out the window. Oh, <laughs> fantastic. I never, you know, I never thought of that. <laughs> mad uh, scientist hair covering mad scientist brains. <laughs> right, exactly. Yes. Hey, the grand just a look. Greg, I want to ask you a question. Uh, human brains in robot bodies is now a realistic possibility. Is this something you'd want in your will, keep your brain alive? Uh, no, none whatsoever. <laughs> Believe me, when this one goes, there's going to be no use for it in any... Uh, blah, blah, blah. Yeah, very so good. anyway, Proving. see, it isn't even useful now! <laughs> there you but, go. The thing about it is, this is some scary science mm -hmm. for women. Let's face it, this is the first step on the way to the Stepford Wives. Mm -hmm. I love the way they say they're developing it for medical purposes, sort of like the way we develop the internet to share information. <laughs> <laughs> I get it. Yeah, it's true. It's true. This is all going to end up... It all, goes, it, it all goes to sex. That's See, all I wouldn't have gotten that if you didn't use the air quotes. I know, the air quotes yeah. always help. <laughs> all right, we'll move on quickly from rat bots to rat burglars.